Introduction to the prostate gland. Structure of the prostate gland. Function. Structure of the prostate gland. The prostate gland is a small chestnut-like organ which is located behind the pelvic bone in the groin. It is distal to the bladder and rests upon the rectum. It adheres firmly to the base of the bladder. The urethra, the tube that carries urine from the bladder through the penis, passes through the prostate. Because of the location, the prostate can impair the flow of the urine if it becomes enlarged. The size of the normal prostate is about 3.5 centimeters side to side and about 2.5 centimeters in its vertical and anteroposterior dimensions. It weighs about 18 grams. The prostate is divided into two main parts, the central zone and the thick outer zone. These two zones constitute most of the glandular component of the prostate. The remaining small portion forms the transition zone. It is assumed that the site of origin of benign prostatic hyperplasia, BPH, is in the transition zone, whereas the peripheral zone is considered a common site for cancer of the prostate. The prostate gland is a firm, partly glandular and partly muscular body. The ducts of the prostate drain into the posterior aspect of the urethra. The prostate grows very slowly until the age of puberty. At puberty, the prostate rapidly grows to more than twice its size. The growth continues until the end of the third decade. The prostate then remains constant in size until about the age of 45 or 50 years at which time there may be a progressive increase in size due to hypertrophy or gradual shrinkage due to atrophy. Benign prostatic hyperplasia usually occurs at this time. Function of the prostate. The function of the prostate gland is to provide part of the fluid called semen. This is important in fertility of the male. The substances within the alkaline prostatic fluid help in sperm motility. Control of growth. The growth and function of the prostate is under the influence of male hormones, testosterone and its derivative, dihydrotestosterone, DHT. Testosterone is produced by the testicles. A small amount of the hormone is produced by a pair of endocrine glands called the adrenal glands. Testosterone enters the cells of the prostate gland. Inside the cell, the hormone attaches to a protein called androgen receptor, AR. A portion of the hormone converts to another hormone, dihydrotestosterone, DHT, which also attaches to the androgen receptor. The conversion of testosterone to dihydrotestosterone is under the influence of an enzyme called 5-reductase. The hormone receptor complex binds the DNA which results in stimulation and growth of the prostate gland. The production and release of testosterone in the testes are controlled by a hormone released from another endocrine gland called the pituitary gland. The pituitary gland is in turn controlled by the LH releasing hormone, LHRH, which is released from part of the brain